you hear a lot of them say like, well, I knew immediately that this is what I wanted to do and I didn't let anything get in my way. And I think for me, like the development was a lot less clear cut. I've been searching for I hope that everybody has the chance to experience that thing of like, it's the first thing you think about in the morning and the last thing you think about before you go to sleep at night. I had always loved music my whole life. And once I started playing in high school, it was the only thing I could think about. As a kid, I was always sort of making up songs, tapping on things. I would see things when I heard music and shapes and colors. And my favorite thing in the world as a kid would be to go on drives because we would get to turn the radio on. Probably for seven years, all I did was I practiced a lot of guitar, a lot of digital production, and was really trying to understand all these sort of like weird ways of creating soundscapes and collages. I didn't get music that sounded like anything I had heard before. It's not her. So I like to write at the guitar a lot. I'll sort of start to get the feeling that there's something coming and usually it's a relationship that I'm inspired by or you know something will happen to me that I have to sort of contend with and if I focus on moving forward in life the songs sort of come along the way. She's moving on the sunshine in my life is gone and I'd rather spend it all alone that's the from day one through now, the constant has always been love songs. I always recognize Julian's influence on my writing. The Strokes were like my first. I've been trying to do the right thing. There's this feeling that Julian's music gives of just the trying your best and it's still not being enough, but then the music itself is actually kind of subdued. I didn't listen to things to get really like amped up. It was always, you know, finding some peace and quiet. Peace of mind. As a whole, like, I think that's what's special about indie artists is that you don't know when your best ideas are gonna come. You're not in control of when your best ideas are gonna come. You're just prepared for them when they do. And I just think that that makes the music believable. Peace of mind. But I'm trying to 